And guys, tomorrow is my birthday. Yikes. I'm literally clickbaiting, y'all. <laughs> I'm so funny. Okay, good morning, guys. Um, I feel like our vlogs have been in the same exact position for the past, like, week. They literally have... Go this way. Hey, okay, new spot of the week. Um, I just blew like my hair out with like the um, wand. What's that called? The brush. Just because my hair was super dry at the end, which it still is. I don't know why. I did a coconut mask, and it made my hair dry rather than hydrated. So, I'm not really sure what that means. But anyways, I had to make a smoothie because we're running late. It's currently 6:48. And my, I have to leave here by like 7, so I have like 10 minutes. But I also don't have any idea where my water bottle is, or where my backpack is, or where my lanyard is. So I'm kind of just like... Oh, Alison, can you stay today after school you have practice? Can you pick me up? No, because I have a, an appointment, and I don't know what time I'm going to finish. So I don't know if What I'm time's happy. your appointment at? 11, but it's far, and it's a long appointment. We need more strawberries, so these ones are literally going old. But it's fine, I guess. You know what I should do instead of like making myself do this? I should just take one of these. They literally like, I know exactly how much protein is going to be in it. And just shove it in there. Duh. Alright, so we're going to make a little smoothie. I made this two times. I made this on the vlog the other day. You guys are consistent watchers. But I'm going to make it again today because I don't feel like having a real breakfast. And this feels like it's going to taste delicious. So, we also need to get mango, but we'll get that out in a second. I should actually get that in first. My favorite thing on this planet. We're not going to do that much because it has a kind of a strong flavor, Loki. Should we do banana? Like, they're literally going bad. So, we could do banana. Oh, my God. These strawberries are actually getting disgusting how bad they are. But we don't buy any new ones. Okay, we're going to shove spinach in there. Now I need to get something to cut the strawberries. See, like, the reason why it doesn't matter is because I'm just going to be, like, blending it. So it doesn't matter what they look like. You know, they might be literally moldy. It's okay. I'm going to blend it. And then we're going to put this whole cup. We've got 15 grams of protein in this whole cup. And it looks like cottage cheese. And it looks like a lot because of the fact that it's, like, tall. But it's not that much. Okay, there we go. Let's go put it in the blender. When I say something super funny, it's actually not gonna be that funny, but it's funny to me. So right now it's pink because it just went through the strawberries. And this is the finished color. How beautiful. So freaking beautiful. It looks like poop. The good thing is it doesn't taste like poop. So we're okay. If I did, I would not be making this right now because I am very much picky and I don't usually like smoothies unless they taste good. So that's how you know it tastes good if I'm making it right now. I actually have to find my backpack like for real because I have no idea where it is and we don't have much time. Okay, yeah, it smells good. It's only really to like right here. Sour. Okay, tastes better today. I put this yogurt, the Oko's or whatever. Okay, let's go find my backpack and my water bottle. I'll give you guys a little overview of my week. Today's Monday. Tomorrow's Emily's birthday. Just so exciting. I don't know where we're gonna go for dinner, but it'll be fun. If I'm gonna stay after school, I need to pack clothes. Which I don't, I really don't wanna stay after school. Unbelievable. Anyways, um, yeah, tomorrow's her. 14th, 14th birthday. Okay, I need, okay, I don't have the hands for all this. How my water? Tomorrow's her 14th birthday, which is freaking insane. A lot of things are happening, and now I can't catch up with it. So, that's pretty much it. But we're gonna pack my bag, and then we'll be good to go. Oh, I got a pimple right where my backpack is. Good morning, guys. It's Monday. And right now we're about to leave. My mom's gonna take me to school, and you're going to a uh, dentist cleaning situation. I'm going to a dentist appointment. And guys, tomorrow is my birthday. Like, I honestly kind of forgot when until my mom mentioned it because 
I've been too focused on all my competitions and stuff. That I forgot it was my birthday tomorrow, but yeah. Anyways, here's the outfit for today. My mom just straightened my hair. When I knew white Lulu. I haven't, it's not new new, but it's my first time like kind of wearing it. Yeah, black jeans, my blazers. Let's go to school. Mm. Guys, I'm so excited to go to school today. And you have three hours practice today. Yeah, it's gonna be so fun. I'm excited for tumbling class, but I saw a video of the team that we're going against next weekend, and they look really good, so I practiced this week. We need to work really hard so that we're really good this weekend, and we win again. Fingers crossed, fingers crossed. Do we have more strawberries, Mom? Or do we need to buy some? We have to buy some. My mom is making... Do you think I need almond, almond butter is the best idea right before you go get your teeth cleaned? I'm gonna wash my teeth before. Okay, good, because that's gonna get all stuck in your teeth. No, I'm gonna wash my teeth. That's crazy. One month of 2023 is basically over. And yesterday was Christmas. Literally. And one more month? Hawaii! <laughs> I keep forgetting about everything that's going on. <laughs> I was like, what? Hawaii. Well, that one. I'm so excited for Hawaii. I need to order new clothes. Well, I have bathing suits because I got a bunch for Christmas. I need to order like pretty dresses for like pictures yeah. and stuff. But yeah, we'll see you guys later. Guys, I'm done with my dentist cleaning situation. Now I don't have to come back until July 31st, at least for cleaning. I do it every six months. I have to come back here the 28th because Emily has an appointment for cleaning at 9 and Allison at 3 p.m. So that day I'm gonna be here two times. Now I'm going to another appointment with Raphael. They clean my teeth, you know, and they use water and all of that. And they took all my makeup around my mouth. So now I have makeup from here up and all of this part, I don't have makeup. So I'm looking amazing for my next appointment. Update guys, one o'clock. I'm done with my second appointment of the day. I have lunch with Rafael. We went to a Peruvian restaurant. The owner is our friend. Oh my god, the ceviche there is amazing. We ate ceviche, yuca frita. Oh my god, I'm so full right now. Right now, I'm in front of a Dollar Tree because I need to buy stuff for Emily's birthday tomorrow. So I'm gonna stop talking because I'm running late. Allison want me to pick her up I don't know if I'm gonna have time if not she can stay at the school because she have weight lifting anyway But let me do that and I will see you later. What do you see new here? Guys look I bought the one and the four and a K for Emily's I went to the Dollar Tree. I bought some gift bags and now I'm in front of Publix and I bought the one and the four and the cake. So time to go home, 1.37. Everything perfect, everything on time. And I text Allison to see if she want me to pick her up and she said no. So mommy can go home and I can work in wrapping or packing Emily's present. Plus I have to edit another video for tomorrow. Guys, look what we have here, 14. I will show you the other thing. And I found this box in my couch. I think came during the weekend when I was in Orlando. So let's gonna open this because I have no idea. I'm having a Celsius. This is my favorite flavor. I need energy, guys. Let me show you. From the Dollar Tree, I bought the one and the four to sing happy birthday. Come for me. This is mail that I took from the mail this morning not this morning like two minutes ago Emily loved this eminent with peanut butter and some bag for her present you know that if they turn 14 she's gonna have 14 presents so let me show you the one that I bought look how cute another hooray happy birthday look this one how cute I like this one too a lot Happy birthday, eat your day, a cupcake. Oh, I think this one I have this double. I was trying to buy one of each one. No, I don't think so. So this one is cute too, with cakes and a happy birthday. So now the moment of truth is what is inside this box. No idea. Oh, 
I know what it is, guys. My Christmas tree is super big. And I bought a thingy to put the Christmas tree inside. And I bought the one that said night fit tree. Well, didn't fit. I will show you. So what I did is I bought two more. And you know the Christmas tree have three division. In each one, I'm gonna put a division. Yes, that's what I did. Let me show you. I have the Christmas tree in my guest room. It is a mess, so don't judge. Ta -da -ta -ta. Here is the polka room. I don't know when we're gonna do another one. This one is another thing that I bought to put one thing that I have inside this box, the thingy. But look, I need something for this and for the other half because this is not enough. And what is inside that box is two more of this red thingy. So you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go to my office, I'm gonna work, and I have to go and pick up Emily and then Allison. And Emily has today three hours practice, six to nine. Yes. Guys, everything is ready, the 14 presents. I know I said the iPhone 14 is gonna be part of this present, so that means she will be open in 13, but no. She has 14 ready for tomorrow, but I think I'm gonna be doing another video for Sister Forever to post it the day of her birthday. So maybe you saw already what is inside these 14 bags. If not, the link is gonna be here so you can enjoy the moment of Emily opening all of this present. I love you, mommy. I wish you the best. You are a good girl, a good daughter, a good sister, a good everything. So we are very proud of you. That's why mommy bought you all of this and daddy too. Peace out. Hello guys, I'm home from school now and I just got like re-ready because I'm going to be filming for my channel right now. I'm doing like a little get to know me video, but today, like my present time, I just posted my like weekend vlog. Oh my gosh, my dad's truck's back. That's so weird to see. <laughs> it's been like broken for like a really long time but it's back now but anyways I'm doing a get to know me video because I feel like it's just been so long since like I've done one of those and I feel like it's really like outdated what you guys might think and just want some fresh new answers so that's what I'm gonna do right now but like to make it interesting I'm saying like get to know me while I drive and originally I was just gonna like get in my mom's car or like the tesla and just sit in there and pretend like i was driving but she has to go pick up emily soon so i'm just gonna do it on the golf cart and be like i'm driving <laughs> but yeah i have to figure out how to set up the tripod the thing is it's a really windy day today so i'm hoping that the audio is not freaking terrible i almost fit okay so here's the camera situation i think i should move the golf cart to where I'm facing straight on with the lighting because you know how the lighting's coming from like this angle right now. So let's move the golf cart. She's literally gonna die too. I don't, she's not even moving. I'm not, I'm not going anywhere. I know. I'm not even going anywhere, but I'm just gonna like park it to make it look like I'm going somewhere. I'm literally click, oh my gosh. Yikes. I'm literally clickbaiting, y'all. It's so windy for no reason. Okay. Shut up, please. Like, literally, it's so freaking windy. So, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the golf cart to the backyard. Like, the back backyard. I hate this sound so much. I'm literally driving with one hand. Hopefully, I don't actually hit the house okay anyways so here's the stitch um it's windy that's the only issue at the moment is the amount of wind that had to come out today and the issue is that my neighbors decided to take down their trees so now their house is like really like in my line of view oh that's really creepy isn't it okay guys look doesn't that house right there, like right there, doesn't that look like somewhere where you keep somebody, like if you them? Okay, I'm scared. I'm gonna not 
to it right here. I had to find like the least windy spot, which I don't even think that's possible. I'm literally gonna run into these sticks right now, but there we go. We made it. Okay, I think we're just gonna do it under this tree, but I need to find like a good spot. You know, this is like a vibe. <laughs> Wait, let's do it in the sun, or should we do it in the shade? Sun or shade? Like, what do you think? Okay, let's see. So like, I can put my tripod up like this, and then like that. <laughs> like this, guys? Is this the vibe? And then I'm just like, I don't know, guys. Give me your very honest opinion right now. Is this stupid or what? Is this bad lighting? It is bad lighting. Where do I get the good lighting, bruh? Do I like go all the way over here? I also have my neighbors on this side, so just like anywhere I go, I have my lovely neighbors. This is really bright. Do I go all the way to the end? I feel like that's like, see, do you, do you guys hear the wind? Like I can't tell right now because like the fact that I'm recording right now and not like playing it back. But like, is this wind really bad? Like, I need you to tell me. Okay, so we're going all the way to the back. Hopefully, there's a better situation back here. Okay. Okay, like, what if I just do it like this? Like, is this good lighting? Okay, yeah, this is good lighting. Okay, guys, I'm gonna go film. See ya!